Yogi Clan, good morning. Welcome back to Yogi Cycle Service. It is good to see you this morning, this Thursday morning. It is beautiful. The hurricane rain has rolled out and it's beautiful blue skies. Speaking of blue skies, what does that bring? That brings sunshine and lots of sunshine. And to a motorcyclist, that can be an awesome thing, right? Unless you gotta spend all day in it because then you look like a potato chip by the time the day is done or a lobster. As I get older, I realize I gotta do a little bit more to protect my skin, right? This weekend, me and the fellows were up in the beautiful state, up in the mountains of Tennessee, about four or five hours from the house here. It was a great ride. It was a great weekend. I'll tell you about that in a different video. But long story short, while I was up in Tennessee, one of our fellows is a tattooed artist. Shout out to Matt from, I believe it's Endangered Tattoos is his uh, shop out of Ahoski, North Carolina. I think I pronounced that right. Anyways, I got a tattoo. It's on my arm right there. So, since I got a tattoo and since I had a long ride home, I don't know if you know much about tattoos, but it's probably since you have like an open wound on your skin, it's probably not really a good idea to slather it in suntan lotion. So here I am in Tennessee, four or five hour ride home, plus gas stops and whatnot. So, you know, a good day, a good day of riding to get home. And I need a way to cover up my tattoo and put on suntan lotion or keep the sun off my tattoo. I had a sweatshirt with me, but it, you know, it was like 92 degrees on a Sunday when we rolled out to come home. It was hot. I am not putting on a sweatshirt to cover up my tattoo. I don't have a long sleeve t-shirt with me. Now I did go to the store and buy some non-stick gauze bandages and some uh, like wrap. So I could have wrapped it all up and put suntan lotion on. But I remembered I had something in my saddle bag that probably could help me that I used this year on my trip to DC. And I wound up using that to help me get home without having to put suntan lotion on. Let me find a place to pull over and I'll show it to you. Although from the title of this video, you probably already know what it is. Anyways, just let the suspense, let the thrill of not knowing what it is capture you for a moment until I get to the park. In the meantime, while you're waiting for me to get to the park, why don't you go ahead and check out some of my other videos on this channel. I got lots of stuff out there. Maybe you find something you like. If you find something you like, smash that subscribe button. We fix motorcycles, we do service. I got all kinds of videos motorcycle related, whether it's working on bikes or just motorcycle related stuff. Or maybe it's just yogi related stuff. So you go do that while I go to the park. But don't forget to come back and watch the rest of this video. So here we are at the park. Feel kind of weird because there's a person right over there watching, getting stage fright. Anyways, I have this tattoo right here that I need to cover up. So what am I gonna use? Well, the first thing I did is I did do exactly what I said. I put the bandage on it and I wrapped it with the ace bandage on top to cover it. And I used a non-stick gauze pad. That worked great. But I'm thinking, do I really want to spray my arm with suntan lotion? And then I remembered I had my sleeves. These are made by SA Company. They're cheap. You like can get like five of them for 20 bucks. Now I realize you have two arms that equals four. Why would you get five? Whatever. I don't know. I don't know why they do that. Doesn't matter. Anyways, I got one with the American flag color. And I got one with black. And I used them going up to DC, like I said. Didn't have to put any suntan lotion on. If you are everybody uses on suntan lotion so I will tell you you know that feeling after you've had it on all day you're just like slimy and grimy 
yeah, I, I didn't want that feeling, especially with a new tattoo. So these things, they're really pretty awesome and they're really easy to put on. Get your arm started. Now there is a big end, there is a small end. So you wanna make sure that the label is down by your wrist. See, down by your wrist. And just pull it on so it's tight. Pull up your arm and it, it's really, boom, done. And I will tell you that these, these are awesome. So would I use them for around town? No, I wouldn't use them for around town. Would I use them? I don't use suntan lotion for around town. But if I'm out there for say, hour and a half, two hours or longer, then yeah, I'm probably gonna put on suntan lotion. Now, am I gonna wear these every time I, I need to? No, I'll probably still use suntan lotion, but you know what, it's nice to have an alternative. And I'll tell you, when it's really hot out, these things, I don't know what, what the heck they're like made of, but they're like cooling, right? So when your sweat gets in there and it evaporates, it's like pretty cool. And I'll tell you, if you take a water bottle and dump a water bottle on it, it'll like give you the chills because when the, when the, the fluids evaporate, it cools off and it does a really good job. And let me tell you, even though it's 92 degrees, just walking around the campground wearing these, I didn't feel hot at all. Didn't make me hot. Matter of fact, it, it, it felt kind of good. <laughs> and, uh, and they, and they keep your arms cool. And if you're riding down the road and you're behind a fairing, you know, if you put your arms down like this, all of a sudden the wind is hitting them. They, oh man, they cool right off. <laughs> they, feel, they actually feel really good. They're unobtrusive. They don't, and yeah, they may look a little funny, but you know what? Like I care. And they worked awesome. And let me tell you, I didn't put any suntan lotion on my arms, either on the DC trip or coming back from Tennessee this weekend. No sunburn at all. The sun does not penetrate through these. So these are a great alternative if you don't like slathering yourself up with suntan lotion all the time. Because let's face it, man, I just, ah, I just feel so nasty when I get home and dirty and grimy because that suntan lotion just attracts all the dirt. It's just, ugh. Now, some people may call me fruity. Let's go back to the Get Back Whip video. Gee, Yogi, my daughter used to have those. Gee, Yogi, those are gay. Gee, Yogi, this is that, and blah, 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 blah. I don't care. I don't care what you think. If these are comfortable for me, I'm going to wear them. And I'm going to suggest them to you because they're comfortable for me. If they work for me, hey, maybe you'd like some too. But it did an awesome job. So my gauze pad and, uh, and the wrap fit under these without a problem. My didn't get any sunburn, didn't ruin my tattoo, and didn't have to worry about contaminating it with suntan lotion. So these things are awesome. So go to SA Company. They're one of the providers that makes them. I don't know who else makes them. I just know that they got ads all over Facebook, right? And one of those one of these days, I, was, I saw this hat that I wanted from there. It was like a wintertime hat and I thought and they're kicking in these for free and I thought hey well let me get some and see how, see how they work so I test them out in DC my buddy I, so like I said I got five right so I gave two to my buddy Steve when we rolled up to DC and he wore one was like a, an American flag red white and blue American flag and the other one was black I think and he wore those and he's like man those are awesome and the moment he got back from DC he ordered more and uh he was sold on them after that after that one trip and that was like a, a nine hour trip up and nine hour trip back i don't want to slather myself with suntan lotion all the time so i use these and they work awesome so there's my tip of the day for you yogi clan hope you have an awesome day thank you for joining me at the park let's get back on the bike and go for a ride i'll catch y'all later peace